What's up guys, Zaf here back with some more on Muji and in today's video I'm going to show, share with you guys uh, some of my duels, some of the videos of my duels which you can find here at the left side of the screen and um, the, there's the duel rules, score determines current tier and rank, honor, honor can be exchanged for items in the mall, so weekly rewards are like jade and skin tokens and so on and so forth. So, in order to access that, you have to go to town, where you'll be at this, this map. So, you tap on duel. Uh, let's check my ranking. So, earlier today was the last time for you to fight as the rankings um, refresh every Monday. Every Monday at 6 a.m. EST. But the last time you can fight is at... Uh, was about 8 to 9 p.m. EST right so after reset on Monday, so that means 8 to 9 p.m. EST on a Sunday is the last time that you can fight well that will be my 9 to 10 a.m. in the morning on a Monday right and the, the rewards will be sent out at 6 a.m. EST so six hours after reset let's check and see how I did this week Last, last week I was like tier 2 This week I tried a bit Oh, there I am Rank 70 Awesome So I'm in tier... What tier am I in? I'm in tier 6 So that means I would get like 320 jade And 10 of these skin tokens So tier 8 Which is uh, requirements are like You need a score of 2400 Then tier 7 You need a score of 2200 And uh tier 6 is 2000 and so on and so forth so you can get these weekly this is really good all right uh, i'm not sure how long i can stay in top 10 because like my souls are pretty shit okay and these guys these guys are pretty good i'm pretty sure that they, they have a lot of good souls and stuff and um i'm gonna share with you guys my fights i'll stop recording here and we're back. So, first duel is against Al Paka, who currently is my guildmate. So let, let me tell you guys first that um, this is the first time me watching the recording. So might be some screw ups, you know. Like I I, I recorded this. I didn't I didn't um, have a mic while I recorded this. So it's a recording, and then now I'm voicing over it. But again, like how I do my videos, there'll be no second takes. I'm just gonna do it all in one take. So any bloopers whatsoever, it's all gonna be in one video take. Cause I'm just lazy like that. And we got wiped. What? Oh, that was quick. Hmm. Right. <clears throat> so this is my journey to the top 100, right? Um, none of the footage will be cut out. It'll be all the fights. But if there are any long fights, I'll try to speed it up or like do something about it. Oops, oops, oops. That's a conversation. Flirting with mother right there. No, no, yeah. yeah. Tengu, that's what she calls it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm kidding, guys. I'm kidding, guys. You know, I'm pretty sure you guys do that too. But yeah. So, how's this fight go? Um, he pretty much has a defensive, like, I, he pretty much has a team that I kind of want to build. Uh, my current team that I'm running, that, that I ran for last week was, um, well, you can see I ran Tengu, I ran Bunny, I, I ran Zashiki, I ran Shuzu, and I ran Hito. Hito is amazing, man. Hito is amazeballs. Like, he's the shit, like, he's anti-AOE. And I can't believe that I got through running Hito with plus zero souls on him. <laughs> I literally ran like, like Shuzu had plus zero souls except for her speed soul on slot two. Um, Bunny, Bunny and so basically Tengu has like plus 15 souls. Uh, Bunny has plus 15 plus 12 mix. Zashiki has like a plus 9 speed soul and the rest is still at plus 0 and same with Hito Shuzu also only has speed at, at plus 15 and the rest is 0 because you know coins and souls you know it's such a dude what's up all right Vervastar hey um I fought him again like yesterday and uh first thing he he, he said 
doing when when I was dueling him is like I watch your videos on YouTube so shout out to Vervista hopefully I, I got the correct guy you know <laughs> and uh, just like yesterday I feel that he's pretty much gonna wipe me right now oh. a bit more crit there maybe because this this was an old recording it was Sunday nights I think uh, I'm pretty much screwed. There we go, GG, bye bye. Yeah, my souls are really bad. Like, like I said, like it's really bad. I I can't get speed. Ooh, YT, ZYT. This could be troublesome. So he's six levels higher than me, and the week prior that he was in top one hundred. And we pretty much run the same setup, except he uses Yaobikuni and Ubumi instead of Utengu. Well, pretty much the same setup. So what I'm trying to do here is... I'm trying to outspeed people, right? And then I connect it with Shuzu. And then I'll try to give orbs to um, Utengu, and then Utengu would then blast people away. And then uh, Kagura would then give more attack power to... Utengu and hopefully Utengu second second third like he'll he'll kill everyone. That's my strategy, all right. Because um, I mean I do have more Shikigamis that I can use, but I haven't really fully understood everyone's functions yet. Right now, like when I play games, usually what I do is I, I try to have a tunnel vision. I'll focus on whatever that I'm working on. Because when I try to focus on so many things at so many at, at, at the same time, right? It's just gonna burn you out. But now now nowadays I'm I'm trying to change my strategy, so I'm not gonna use an attack bar buffer the next time around. I have duels. Well I don't think it's gonna happen this week. It's probably gonna happen like next week or something. But this is gonna be a really slow fight, I can see. Um What do I do? Do I still commentate? So he's taking this very carefully, so am I, like we're going really slowly. I outsped him, right? Yeah, I outsped him. But both of us are being very pussy right now because of both of us have Hito. And none of us want our DPS to die. But I went for it. And I'm still alive. And I'm gonna die. Now, what was I thinking here? I was thinking of trying to stun you. Choose one, but that didn't happen. Oh, Tengu's gonna die. I gave that afterlife to him, like, the round before. Okay, here's the thing. I give afterlife to Tengu. I want to give afterlife to Tengu so that whenever I fight Hitos, right, I give afterlife so that I hit them with the AoE, right? Hopefully I hit them with the AoE again, but if I die, then I'll come back, I'll be resurrected. Well, well I'm hoping for my whole team to like withstand the damage, okay, until it's time for me to resurrect. And when I resurrect, then I hit them with the AoE again. But I'm really not sure what's going on, so let's just watch this. <laughs> I really should like watch the whole video first before commenting now, shouldn't I? It's alright, it's alright. I mean like okay, here we're back we're back. And uh, What the fuck did I do? No! No! See how stupid? I was really stupid. Ah oh, man! <coughs> Oh man, stupid me. See, see, this this is one good thing about having your matches recorded, you know? Then you can tell, like, what you did wrong and what you should have done. So that the next time around, when you're gonna fight, when you're gonna fight someone again, you know what to do, you know? And that match, I, I kind of fucked up. Like, I think it was the first time I was trying that um, resurrection thingy. So I still couldn't get a handle on it. Celebris. 
Same team. I, I pretty much just used the same team. It's safe. It's safe to use the same team at start because it'll, it'll help you learn more about team mechanics. So what are we fighting here? We're fighting Hito. We're fighting. Is oh. That looks disgusting, like, looks like it'll kill me easily. Not. I don't know. Come on, Channel Storm. No, Afterlife first. Is that what I did? Alright, I gave Afterlife first. So in case he dies, he just comes back and leaves. Hopefully this this hopefully this one can show showcase the resurrection. Cause I'm not really sure. <laughs> I've got the protect on. Sammy's protect is OP, you know, like um, a high level Sammy with like max level totem. Can really bring the hurt. Oh, everyone's dead. I don't think we have enough time for. Yeah. Okay, again, strategy sucked. K7 Sophie. What do we do here? What did we do here? You know you have to bear with me guys because I'm I'm not used to commentating on this fight yet, so you know along the weeks and months to come obviously I'll get better at this, but right now right now I see what I can see right now from the fights is that people have really quick tools. Okay. And I'm not sure how long I can last in the speed game because right now even right now currently um, my Yama Usagi is at 207 speed um, in this video it was 202 I think yeah I've got five speed in in the in the past two days extra for her ah they had a uh, Senesio on I think it was Senesio so it inflicts days by the way days is the stun thing Right, so I don't understand why can't they just call it stun. So Daze is stun. So Tango is stun. And I hate, I hate fighting Samurai X. You know, because that taunt is so, so useful. You know, when 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 you taunt and you can do nothing but first skills, right? Uh, basic attacks, it's really OP. Especially when everyone is still at this early game stage where all their souls are not powered up yet and everyone's not at grade 6 and everybody's still running like grade 3, grade 4s, grade 5s and their stats are not there yet. So it's pretty OP having all your skills blocked where, because you can just get wiped in a single turn whenever they do it. Like, he almost, he almost. I was almost wiped but Hito killed off his... Hito killed his... Um, Attacker. So what's gonna happen here? Okay, it's gonna be a problem. Can Tengu survive? If Tengu survives this, we can probably win. Come on, survive it, Tengu. You can do it. What? Son of a bitch! And we left. Hmm. Next fight. I swear to you guys, I, I got I got into top 100, okay? So just wait for it. The, the fights will get better, okay? It's not always gonna be me losing. Yes, I dropped down a tier here, right here. But but no, this, this whole 37 minute length video that I have in front of me right now, is what's the fight right does this look like how a good day looks like yeah this probably looks like how a good day looks like this is when my team strategy works as intended i think i think i'm, I'm not sure but supposedly i outspeed them 
I connect my circuit. You know, Zashiki does this. I would like to have my Tengu like another four speed faster or five speed faster at least. Um, so then he can do this. All right, awesome. So basically, this this is it. This is the strategy that I was aiming for. Obviously, there's some things that I need to tweak. Like I need Tengu to be faster, like 70% of um, Yama Usagi's 75, 76% of Yama Usagi's. Um, oh my God, we fight YTs at YT again. Wow. I'm not sure how my emotions were at this point in time when I was fighting him. But yeah, so basically you want you want to have your, your attackers, your monsters, like the slowest one you want to have 76% of your attack bar buffer. You know, that was the math in Summoner's Wall. There was some lengthy explanation to it, but I'm pretty sure when they say 30% attack bar, it's 76%. It's definitely not 70%, so yeah. You know, so you just, because you don't want the enemy to overlap. So what happened here? I went and YOLO'd it. I did the AOE first. Again, I'll try and target Shuzu, seems. Didn't work. What did I do here now? Did I YOLO again? No, I'm giving Afterlife. I think this is the one where the Afterlife worked, because I'm pretty sure that it happened. I'm excited, I'm excited to see what happens. So I gave Afterlife, and, and he went back to the War of Attrition. Slowly hacking away at um, what do you call this Tengu, because th there's only there's only two reasons why he's, he can do this. One, he just wanted to piss me off and slowly do this, and for me to quit. Two, his souls are equally not as good as mine, right? Or or about the same there, where we can just die whenever if our main DPS is gone, basically the fight is over. Right? Because, yeah, I, I haven't invested in their souls yet. So what happened is I went YOLO again. Then we got back to... Um, so he died. Like, obviously, Tengu died. So is this exactly the same as the first match? It's a mirror. Almost, I mean, the first match, the first time around that we fought YT is at YT. So this time around, did I change stuff up? I hope I change stuff up. This might be the one where we win. I don't know. Is it? But I can foresee that in the future, fights are gonna be somewhat like this, you know, like really slow. It's not gonna be like a, an AOE clear, like how it is currently. You know, currently is you outspeed someone, you get your buffs up. One AOE, two AOE, wipe the whole team, move on to the next fight. Now, I'm pretty much sure in the future, What's going to happen is it's going to be this really slow, like like a chess game kind of thing, you know, and each match could even take up to like 20 minutes. It's probably not fun. I mean, let me tell you guys, honestly, um, I, I do want to be competitive, but at the same time, I'm like, I'm enjoying the pace that I'm playing the game right now, which is like, I'm casually playing it. So Tango's back up, and now I learned from my mistake the first time around, so I didn't know AOE here. And I died. And what happens here? Well, I died. <laughs> oh, crap. Can we actually kill him? I'm unsure. Well, that 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 failed. I'm I'm, I'm not gonna edit this part of the video. Out. I'm just gonna cut it short. <laughs> so right now, let's. Uh, I'll just wait and see, see how it goes. See whether I did I quit or did I go on and fight. Come on, you can do this. Tengu died. Man, he, he throws so good, you know, that reflect. 
really good. I should I should build a Ibaraki to like handle these kind of things, but I don't have it right now. Now it's gonna take some time to do that. And Shuzu's link will heal him. I still have my Hito, so there's a chance that he would die for my Hito. <coughs> but he's got damage dealer still though. And I don't see myself winning this. But I'm pretty sure I did beat him once. I'm not, just, just not sure whether this was the one that we beat him with or, or it was something else. Yeah, this sucks. Super slow, and none of us are yielding. You know? Like, like none of us are yielding. Like, it's like I'm trying to see what he's going to do, and he's trying to see what I'm trying to do. And 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 it's a learning process. So it's like I learn from this. You know, I say like different different things that you do during the fight to watching recordings to learning it again. And uh, he's probably trying to see whether how he can like speed up his wins if he's in the same situation. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that's what a lot of people do. So, so I changed my strat here. What I did was I tried to basically I'm I'm trying to stun that Ubumi. I should just quit because this is like minutes. And he kills the Shiki. And I'm dealing my mediocre 135 damage. And his Hito hits for 433, so that's quite a bit. That's quite a fair bit. Oh, I switched to auto. Now, if I'm switching to auto, that means I'm gonna die. I, I, I pretty much gave up. If I switched to auto, that means I pretty much gave up. He killed off uh, Hito's dead, so he's gonna do an AoE this run, I'm sure. Oh, we killed Shuzu! Ah, no, we did. Wow, how many minutes was that? That was a long ass time. <laughs> Sorry for wasting your time, guys. Kovolinus. So, we went back down the tier. So, now we're in tier 5. And you can see by the background, like every time the background changes, that means you either go up a tier or you go down a tier. And um, we're fighting against a similar team to mine, except that instead of Hito, he's using Ibisu. It's pretty cool. Pretty much works too. Um, here's the thing. My, my my tunes are not quick enough, right? So although I can go first, the, like my bunny is okay-ish speed and Shuzu is alright, but because the rest of my squad is not quick enough, you know, we, we're kind of susceptible to like being cut anytime. Yeah, cool. Alright, so he's in a rush, like, like he gave up that fight. Oh, who here is from Malaysia? I am. Right. Verlius. I fought him a few times. He's be pretty tough. Like, oh, he's already at max level, level 60 already. Oh, why am I looking at chat? Alright, there we go. Let's go, we outspeed him. What's he got? He's got two attack bar buffers. He's got... What, what does it say there? Right side, motherfucker. Is that what it says? Riverside. Oh, Riverside, motherfucker. Okay, I have no idea what that means. 
probably the place where he comes from. Representing something, perhaps. I don't know. <clears throat> okay, so so how people are trying to deal with um, Hito is they're still going with their single, like single attacks, uh, instead of doing their AOEs. Whilst I don't care. I'm pretty much dead now, am I? Well, maybe we can survive this. Do you win this? Is he still going with a single attack? Yeah, he's still going with a single attack. Right, I think we pretty much will win like the next turn. Oh, Shuzu's link is out. No, we're gonna lose. We're definitely gonna lose. Oh, it's taking so long. Make your decision. And come on, kill off that thing. Ooh, so tinky. Oh man, we're gonna die. <laughs> but there's only that much left of his tengu, you know, like like he's supposed to die right then. So yeah, so I think what I'm noticing is a lot of people's strategy is when we have Hito, what they do is they just single target the the, the damage dealer. And he's trying to taunt um, Tengu, but Otengu has that um, ability to negate one status effect. Wow, we're gonna die right here, right? 6,100 shit. Or are we gonna get lucky right here? Come on, do it! Oh, he left. <laughs> so it's pure luck, pure luck. Pure luck that we won, right? Because I have no idea whether we could have killed his Tengu or not. But pretty much that was his strategy when fighting Hito teams. So, searching, searching. Uh, there, I'm, I'm looking at the, the roll, the video roll right now. There's like 11 minutes more. So I th I think we pretty much win the next few fights, maybe. Cause like I'm nowhere near the score that I had when I when I ended the fights. Shoyan. What do we have? Uh, pretty similar setup again. Like, like we're, we're meeting a lot of teams like this, where their plan is to outspeed, uh, to speed up. Then after that, have Shuzu Link. Then, uh... yeah, basically everybody's. A lot of people are using this team, like this. Not not just this team, that, but this sort of setup. You know, like they, they they have one damage dealer, they have a healer, or they have a damage mitigator. In my case, I, I have Hito as my damage mitigator. He has Ibisu as his healer, you know, instead of damage mitigator. So he's got Bunny, Attack Bar Buffer, Zashiki Lighter, which is pretty crucial. But I, I do have I do have monster uh, Shikigamis that do not require orbs to be good. Like I have Shuten and I have Vampira. I might 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 build them. Not sure. I'm still thinking about it. Uh, Tango still wipes the floor with it, and uh, he left. One, rank seventy-three. So one nine six four. That's my score currently. One nine six four. I ended at two zero three five. YTZ YT again. Oh my god. Okay, I have a good feeling. This is the one we won. I need to watch this as well. Because this is the third time in this reel that I'm fighting him, and I think 
looking at the time, this is the one that I beat him. So I, I have to pay attention as well to see what I did right this time. Okay, so I did the same thing. Attack bar buff. Um, have my safety net with Shuzu. We got my lighter. Uh, what did I do here? Did I do AOE? Did I do single target? I, I need I need to learn this because I need to know what, what is it that I did right. I think I was taking my time thinking about what to do. Might have went single target. If I did, I went single target, I hit... Um, I hit Ubume. Eh? Now what do I do now? I think I know what I did now. And now he says hello. I say hello back. So they're trying to inflict the days on Shuzu, but unfortunately none, none of it landed. Um, so he gets to connect. And he, he's going the same skill. Like, um, Oh, but this time around he's trying to take over Zashiki. So he's trying to kill my lowest HP member. Because this is third, third time fighting, so he pretty much knows like the health pool of everyone. Already. So he's gonna bring out his carp now, I'm sure. Okay, what is carp? Trade off again. So it's a war attrition between the two of us. Oh, finally we get a stun on Shuzu. Okay, so I give resurrection to Tengu. Increase my attack bar. Uh, so basically, I stun Shuzu in hopes that he doesn't have a skilled up Shuzu, so that by the next time around when she comes up, um, the connection is cut. Right, and the damage is not shared. But apparently not. Uh, his shoes were skilled up. Only mine wasn't at the time. Now I decide to go YOLO because I already have the afterlife on, on him. Try to stun him again. Didn't work. Stun. Give the respect sign. I. I I, until now, I still have no idea what that means. Like, so respect for going YOLO, or like for <laughs> respect for being a dumbass and, 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 and killing off your DPS. Right, so I, I think maybe it's just respect for going YOLO. And now we're out of ops. I don't have the circuit going. And. What was I trying to do? Was I trying to say something to him? Might be. But he's still not going for the AOE offensive though. Stun that Ubume. No. circuit back on yeah he still didn't go for the AOE offensive all right Tengu's back and his Ibisu is dead managed to wipe his Ibisu and the reflect didn't kill uh, kill off the, the, the clone so he's still there so that's luck right there Luck that Hito's um, reflect didn't, uh, didn't kill off the, the Tengu. What do we do? Stun Shuzu? Stun Ubumi? Stun Ubumi. Oh, nice! We managed to stun Ubumi. And, and he was trying to like channel storm to Tengu, but you can't control like. Um, you can't control people who are, who are, who are in spirit form. Got another circuit running. I'm pretty sure the next time around Tengu gets a turn, 
He's dead. Like, like that. that their whole team's dead. This is really, really slow. Awesome, and he's dead. Like, like he only has Tengu. Nice, nice. I should have replied to him. Why, why was I being such a dick without replying him? Awesome, and th that's how we won. So uh, I think that was purely luck based. Now we're at 1999. One, nine, nine, nine. Nope, never mind, I can't sing. It's a really old song. <laughs> that was embarrassing. Come on, where's the next fighter? This is what really, really close to cutoff time already. Really, really close to cutoff time. I think people have stopped fighting at, at this point in time. Like, they... they they're pretty much done, they already have their ranks and uh, I was, I still wasn't top, I still wasn't top 100 yet. I think this next match is the one that made me go up to top 100. Oh no, I was already top 100, sorry. I was already top 100 but I, I didn't hit the cutoff for, because I didn't fight the day after. So we're fighting Ri. Wasn't her points a lot higher than me? I'm not sure whether her points are higher than me or not. So she's running a speed team, but we managed to outspeed and link. Right, the thing is, even if we manage to outspeed, but if I can't get link going on, I'm pretty much dead. But if we can get the water circuit going on, then uh, there's a high chance that we can survive this. Right, so she didn't go for the quick way. But she still went AOE. And... That killed off Hito, but took off half, only half though, only half of his uh, health. Ooh. Ooh. Tango survived. And we won. So I was at rank 46 here. I think that was the last fight. Yes, because my score is 2035. Uh, wow. I think there's some really bad commentary for me throughout this whole video. I, I do apologize. I apologize for your ears, you know, for the whole 37 minutes that I've commentated on this um this this dueling video. I'll I'll improve in the future for sure, you know, next time, you know what, next time, instead of me watching it and commentating at the same time, I'll watch it first, okay, so I'll know what to say, <laughs> you know, it'd probably be cringy as fuck, right, like whatever it was that I was trying to say, I, I, I can imagine it right now, you know, like, like, like how cringy it would have been, and yeah, that was my duel to top 100. I think that's the only time that I'll be able to get the top 100. Uh, after this, people will be a lot faster, a lot quicker than me. Um, and I don't think I can take advantage of that anymore. But yeah, but duels are fun. Duels are fun. Uh, I've had a few fun fights the past couple of days. A lot of people being saying hi, saying that they've watched my videos. It's pretty cool. I'm like, whoa, nice. Thanks, man. Thanks, guys. Like, I didn't know like people actually watch it. Like, I do know people watch it. Yes, obviously, I do know people watch it. But I didn't know, like, like... People in the top 100 are watching it. I'm like, oh, okay, cool, awesome. Hopefully, some of the videos help, and um, hopefully, you guys learned something from this. I mean, I, I learned that I need to watch my videos first and then commentate like after I know what's going on. Right? That's one I, I learned. Number two, what I've learned was um, well, that my my souls are pretty shit, and and I need to do something about it. So yeah, that's that's the biggest lesson that I can I can think of from here. And I will try to improve. So, this is Love signing out then. Till next time, guys.